Good morning and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this morning with Fred and your girl Lexi. And what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is her ability to understand and respond to her obedience commands, some on, some off leash commands. Now, the first thing that we want to introduce to you is the training equipment that we're using. And we're using a regular six foot web training leash. And Fred keeps the bulk of that folded in his right hand. That leaves the left hand free to give the correction. And the only correction that we use is a little tug and let go on the slip collar. And that is the second piece of equipment that we're using. And she is sitting very nicely at Fred's left, which is where all of our obedience training is done. And the first exercise that they're going to demonstrate for us is healing. The command is Lexi heal. And at this point, Lexi has a job to do. And her job is to stay even with Fred's left leg, not forging ahead. And each time that he stops his feet, she knows to sit automatically to wait for her next command. Lexi's biggest problem is that she can be temperamental and she thinks that she can call the tune as to when you start and stop obedience training and what we're going to help teach you is how to incorporate all of this into your everyday situations. Now the next exercise that Fred's going to demonstrate for you is the sit stay. It's going to Use the open flat of his left palm about an inch or so from her muzzle and the one word firm command to stay. stay. He drops his leash and walks away. And she likes to lay down on her long sit stays and I think it's just a comfort thing with her. But Fred's going to get her up out of it and make her complete it as it was taught. This time he'll hold on to the leash to make sure that she completes the exercise. I'm going to leave her in a stay, and this time she's, he's going to hold on to the leash and make her hold that sit stay. Practice these right in your house. One to three minute sit stays, three to five minute down stays. When Fred returns back to her, he walks all the way around her as an additional distraction, all the way back to heel, and at this point she always expects to get another command. going to leave her in another stay and he's going to demonstrate the recall or the come on command. He praises her on the way in and she should come and sit. She shouldn't come and bowl you over and then back to heel and back sitting. He leaves her again in another sit stay. Calls her in, has her sit, and then returns back to heel and back sitting. Very nicely done. Now we're going to demonstrate her down commands. And I know some of this Lexi knew, but Lexi has a habit of doing things when she wants to, not when she's told to. She's very selective. And she can have a bad day and make you think that she doesn't know anything. This time Fred's going to take the open flat of his palm straight down toward the ground and the one word command to down and then he leaves her in a stay. He'll give her another stay command and drop the leash and walk away. Just give her another stay. stay. This time he drops his leash and walks away from her. And she's much better at holding her. Yeah, now she's going to sit on the down, right? <laughs> down, on the, down on the sit and sit on the down. Very good. Now we're going to demonstrate that down from a heel one more time. So always have your dog seated before you attempt to put her into a down. Her shoulder should be next to your left leg. Stay. And you should practice these exercises everywhere that she goes. When you take her to the barn, at home, in the house, outside. Repetition, repetition, repetition. 
This time Fred's going to call her out of that exercise. And then she's going to go back to heel. Very good. Now the next exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is you're down from a distance. So Fred's going to leave her in a sit-stay. He's going to walk out to the end of his training leash. She'll also do this off the leash. We were just practicing with her. He's going to use his right hand to give the command and the one word command to down. That's your down from a distance. Now you're going to get more instruction when you come to pick her up as far as how to proceed into off-leash training and everything that she's learned, answer any questions that you have. We've really enjoyed having her. She's done a good job and there are days that she was extremely challenging. So she's come a long way and we look forward to seeing you very soon. Thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company.